going to teach how to set up the bronchoscope and uh, how to connect the machines with the scope, everything and how to check pre working or not. Then only we have to give to the doctors for the procedure, any ball or uh, tracheostomy. Okay, before that we are keeping the accessories inside the machine, like this, hanging like this. So you can take this cover all inside, needed accessories inside, okay. Yeah. Mainly this is for suction bag, mm -hmm. single use suction bag. You just open like this, take it. It is all available here. Okay. okay. This is a single use suction valve. Use one patient and throw it. Okay. This is a suction valve. Then next one is ball culture also we are keeping the inside the mucus extractor one or two. Then this is the those are taking valve, this mouthpiece. Just uh, the bite block. We have to use the bite block. Okay. Okay, open and put it a bite block and yeah, this is bite block. Also, we are keeping inside. Then, suction, the saline installation valve, biopsy valve. This is the one. This is also available inside. Even you can semi disposable. We can use it three or four times and wash it and keep it in, in the scope. What the okay? wash with water only? No, no, with the uh, side except Washing, I will take a separate mm -hmm. video. Okay. This is only how to set up. This is the accessories needed. Okay. So this is the thing, only the single use suction valve and the biopsy valve for saline installation. These are the accessories needed and my, this bite block also I show you before and this one. So this is regarding the accessories available for the scoping. Then we have the power button, the plug power cord, we have to connect it to the power point and switch on. So it is indicating this machine is connected to the power. So now we have to connect the machine to the scope. So how we can connect the machine to the scope? I will show you. So we already washed and kept it like this. So we have to take it the scope. We have the two different scopes. This is like big. This is eight millimeter scope. This will fit only uh, eight eight size tube, eight and eight point five only. If the ET tube was 7.5 or 7, you can use the 6 mm scope. This is smaller one. You have to take. Okay, those are female patient intubated on a smaller size tube. Always use tracheostomy, always use this this type of scope mainly. So this is the first button. You have to press this one first. Now the second one. Okay, now the third one. Then fourth one is here. The image will come the screen okay great see now okay now machine is on now but i i still i didn't switch on the light source so we have we have here button this is a light source button we just press this one so light is coming you can see now the light is coming scope is lighted okay so now is ready so we already connected everything so we should be like this okay now connected everything the scope everything is there before that we have to before the procedure we have to check the angulation this one you can see the scope now angulated upwards angulated downwards so so this will be this is the one adjusted adjusted yes sure. down mm -hmm. up yes. again just yes, show that the uh, left one uh, yeah. if down behind the yeah. up means down yeah down means up just to turn that one the yeah. Yeah. You can see the down scope. Yeah. Ah, yeah. We should be. So before giving to the doctors, always check the ambulation working properly or not, and the light source is working or not. Okay. So you just keep the some uh, gauze pieces and go to the camera. Is like this clear. Yeah. Okay, that means okay. Even if it is some blurred, which means with a gauze with the saline and clean it and see the brightness. Okay, you can increase the brightness from here. You can go to up, the brightness will increase. Okay. If you want to down, down brightness. So, this is the main setting. Switch on the machine and connect the cope from here to the machine. Now, connected, everything ready. Now, we are going to attach the as I said before, the suction valve and the 
इंस्टॉलेशन चला इंपोर्ट यहाँ पर जस्टर Okay, just again, just place it like this, like this. Click on, connect it, this one. Now we are going to attach the saline installation port down. Attach like this, you can close. Okay, this two connection. Then main suction source, we have to connect the tube in here and finish. Now they can give to the doctors for the lubrication. You can use the Vaseline gauze or the Sopratol. will just lubricate and give to the doctors before that you have to put one uh, blue sheet put the uh, uh, gauze pieces international connector then number syringe two and with the uh, dressing set with the saline keep it everything ready and for the for uh, installing saline or something to clean up that's why put the sopratol clean it attach the international connector to the endotracheal or tracheal tube just give to the scope Before that, we have to check angulation working or everything fine. Okay, then only you can start to give to the doctor. They can manipulate on. If needed saline, you have to flush saline through here. If you want to connect bar, take that one. That mucus extractor, one ninety CB. I will show you how to connect. This is a disposable one. Okay. Anyway, it is now available. No problem. So you have to take like this. This is for demonstration purpose. I am not completely sterile. Okay, for the procedure, you have to be sterile. Okay, this end going to connect here completely connected. This end we have to cut one section catheter, 14 size or something. The near to the section end connect. This one will connect. That one close. Connect to the section. Then you can take this one like this. Okay, for the ball cultures. If you want a second, uh, this one don't need to throw it. Everything put again. Just remove from here yeah. and change the bottle yes. only. Okay, this is regarding the connections to set up everything. Already we kept the scope no, not in the box. We are already washed and kept it in the sheet like this. Whenever you take, mm -hmm. you do that. Like this, you have to arrange, check everything before you count the machine. Everything ready. You call the doctor. They can. After finishing the procedure, you have to carefully check the scope whether it is okay, uh, inspection everything okay, the angulation working, camera working. Then only. Otherwise, this is misused by the doctors. Even before starting procedure, also you have to check everything. Light source working, angulation working, everything. After finishing procedure, we have the documentation uh, book in the medical side. You have to document the patient, the label sticker, put the label, patient details, and which doctor done. Which doctor done? Which sister assisted? Something. This procedure happened. They are giving medication. If they are only using the bowel culture, but uh, they have to give pre medication, sedation, muscle relaxation. Uh, if they are not giving any muscle relaxation, just better to use the mouth, this uh, bite blow. Otherwise, the patient will bite the scope. This will get things. Okay, to avoid the damage. So this is. Then finally, okay, you finish the procedure. How we can switch off the machine? So first start with this button. Switch off in the reverse manner. Stop, stop, stop. Finish. Now how we can remove the machines? First we have to this one. Remove and put it here. Remove. Then we have to place this water resistant cap. So during the to clean it with the alcohol, everything nicely. Then keep it for the sterile wash. Flushed with everything like this. Okay, we have the flusher here. See, somebody lost it, so I I found a new one. This one for the flushing and cleaning. So you have to one this connected here. This one connected here, and we have to 50 ml syringe saline and completely. So every junks will be removed. You can flush all colors. So where you, where you are keeping this one? From the washing area. Uh, this one only. No, no. I mean this connection. From where it got? Yeah, I got it because it was loose, right? Ah, yeah. I find it from water. Water. 
but yeah. we have to be very careful with this. Yeah. It is, we don't have that much. Yeah, that much. We have only two. So this is the one. So we will take it out. Washing, I will keep it separate with you. Okay. Done. So bedside clean everything. If the 70 percent alcohol, clean the outer surface, everything. Put the water resistant and flush with the saline, everything. The junks will be removed from the bedside. So scope is clean. Then you can flush the 70 percent alcohol through through this. Uh -huh. So everything will go. 70 percent is alcohol, no problem. So you can remove everything now. Remove from the scope. First with the saline. Saline. Then next is 70 percent alcohol. Just to turn number, just put it. No, do you think the side is... Side is the sterile cleaning. I am telling the bedside process. Bedside you have to clean everything. You have to remove it from the patient's side. The scope should be cleaned everything. Then only we can go for another sterilization. Okay? Yeah. Close it now. Okay.